ladies and gentlemen, will be starting in uh, 10 minutes, this lush Doha thing. So, uh, ladies and gentlemen, startups, hopefully we'll have everybody in the front row. Garaj, Saad, Guy, Hamad, where is everybody? All right, so uh, welcome to the startup scene and today is the uh, slush day, right? So uh, we'll be starting our first activity for the Innovation Theater 2014 and uh, uh, I would like to welcome uh, our startups who are competing today uh, to be in uh, the biggest uh, startups and investment events taking place in Helsinki in uh, 2014, November 2014. So uh, I don't see Abdelaziz. Where is Abdelaziz Shalhoub? Yeah, Abdelaziz. Welcome aboard. So uh, today we have a startup uh, competition. This competition uh, originally was designed to be between regional uh, Startups. So we had invited three Saudi startups and three Qatari startups. Unfortunately, uh, two of the Saudi uh, startups were not able to make it for various uh, purposes that came at the last minute. So uh, we'll be having four startups instead of six. And uh, I mean, we'll be having a lot of activities. We will be having a, a talk uh, presented by Intel Capital, uh, Barish Aksoi, the uh, senior Director for Investment uh, in Intel Capital will be there with us very soon and we will be having a very interesting panel discussion on how can you fly your startup uh, globally. So uh, I, I would love to invite Henry, Henry Holm uh, representing uh, the Startup Sauna Foundation. He will be uh, orienting us on what is slush and what is the aim of Slash Doha, and then he will take us on this interesting journey. Henry, thank you so much. Thank you. Good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon. My name is Henry Holm. I am here to present the Startup Sauna Foundation Finland. Uh, I would like to spend a few minutes with you just to run through the agenda for the afternoon. So we will be covering a little bit of the background of the Startup Sauna and the Slush event. That gives a little bit of a glimpse and insight to the cold winter event now in a, in a late spring, early summer here in Doha. Also, we will be going through uh, various stages of the evaluation of the ideas and the startups, the four startups. We will have a chance to coach and discuss. Every time when you present your own ideas and your ideas of your company, there's a possibility for new discoveries. Some of the old ideas becomes obsolete, and some of the old ideas becomes actually the new ideas, which are then the prominent and the drive of the company and the product what you present. At 4 p.m. we will have the pitching competition. It's a five minute, very intense, uh, straight to the point pitch. Why would I invest to this particular event or company or product? And like mentioned earlier, we will have a panel discussion about going global and then finally uh, announcing the winners for the event. Without any further ado, I also want to uh, send uh, regards from the CMO of the startup sauna, Martin Talvari. Martin was here today, very early morning hours. But because of the uh, visa regulations, he was not able to enter the, the country uh, with the 72-hour visa, which we thought would be possible. So my apologies for that. But uh, the presentation covers all the key messages what Martin wanted to leave with us. So Slash and Startup Sauna program. So Startup Sauna is an organization which was created around uh, one country, Finland, in a very um, uh, at this, a crucial stage, I would put it this way, because the country was taking a lot of youth into a company called Nokia, and that saga, which lasted from mid-90s till uh, 2007, 8, 9, 
uh, until now, uh, being a part of the Microsoft Corporation, uh, Hanset Division, uh, took a lot of talent from the schools. And at the time when we went to the schools and we asked students, how many of you would like to be an entrepreneur? Very few raised their hands. And at the time, you know, the, uh, the entrepreneurship was not seen as a very glamorous choice. It was seen as a different choice to the one that people would take in you know, a large corporates. But every time when we look back into the uh, nation's uh, growth, it is important to recognize that everything starts from small. And we need to incubate the ideas and the spirit of entrepreneurship no matter what. So we remind ourselves, you know, also in the startup sauna, uh, our meeting room, one of the meeting room is actually looking like a sauna. It is a place where you go, you sit down, you, you know, share your ideas and thoughts, the whiteboard, a good Wi-Fi connection, and uh, you may book the, the venue at, at, your, at your wish. And this is part of the, the, the whole idea, how this is put into a conversation. It is a conversation where we want the ideas to find the ones who want to invest and then also nurture the ideas because not necessarily is the first idea the best one. We run twice a year program. Uh, we start the spring program after the uh, March and April local events in May. And now it's finishing in May, uh, June 4th, starting on May 5th. And during that five week intense program, uh, not only we learn a lot about the new startup companies, but also the startup companies, they learn a lot about themselves. So the founding members get to know each other in a totally different depth and, and even ideology, because sometimes the ideas have to be driven by you know, a much deeper vision or passion than just making money. And during this uh, July, there's a Silicon Valley visit, and then uh, we start the second program in October and, and uh, the first program actually finishes into a slush event in November. The 70 plus local events accumulates about 10 startups per event, uh, 700 startups coached. Um, we get about 1,800 applications. That will actually be uh, a, a twice as much um, going forward now. And, uh, those eight batches which we have done so far, over 100 alumni companies has graduated. And if you look at the investment amount, it's still a very relatively small amount, but we talk about smaller economies investing into the, uh, the companies. So in, in uh, prorated ratio, actually it is already a significant amount. Yes, please don't then click We have handpick investors and venture capitalists who are then uh, helping to the startup companies to grow and then coach them and this is really to share the network what these people have built or each one of us have built over the years on doing the international business and here's the catch we are a non profit and it is an organization which is not taking equity in your company so each one of us participate to this one to bring your company into a greater new heights and giving you the opportunity to actually grow. Then about the slush. Slush event is, is something that, you know, during the cold winter month of November, there is no reason really to go outside. It's cold, it's miserable, it's slushy, it's icy weather. So it's a good idea to stay inside and innovate. Make your best ideas to flourish and come and share those with us. In 2008 and 10, it was very, very small, uh, almost indie event where people who were really enthusiastic about building this new ecosystem of startups and putting, putting this vision of 2020, we will have a flourishing, very new uh, breed of businesses uh, coming out of, out of the new countries. Um, it was just a matter of tens of companies coming together. 2011 and 12, it became hundreds. So suddenly we realized that 3,500 visitors, 550 companies has been with us, and the numbers are growing. Now 2013, we had 7,000 uh, attendees, which we expect now to be 15,000 this year. Uh, 68 countries, crossing 100, hopefully, next, uh, and, and during the next event. And then 1,221 startups, crossing then 2,500. 
this major event gives an opportunity for then matchmaking, one-to-one -one conversation between the investors and then the startups. Again, we take no stake on that. We facilitate, we give the premises. Finnish government supports the, and the Helsinki government supports the event and gives us the, the venue. Overall, $70 billion uh, of worth of assets these venture capital firms uh, are presented uh, in the event. Also large media coverage. So why to do this? We believe that we have to build a, this really well-functioning startup ecosystem across Eurasia. And what do we mean by well-functioning? Is actually connecting this ecosystem then to the rest of the world developing ecosystem. There is not just one ecosystem, there is actually many. And us uniting our thoughts and ideas well together, we can actually generate more uh, wealth, more also opportunities, and more jobs for the future generations. So all this voluntary organization, hundreds of people, um, they put their own personal time and thought to make this all happen. And we would like to then, of course, you know, to share this uh, thought with all the uh, competitors and the winners. So from today's event, uh, the winning company will be joining us to the Slush event in November 1819 in Helsinki. And uh, let's see what it's all about. Thank you. Thank you. Great, so I think we have the energy, huh? So who would like to be in Slush in November? I would love to. All right, great, great. Guys, I would love to invite our competing startups to, to be the on stage. So I will start with the, with the guest. I'll start with Abdelaziz Al Chalhou from Saudi. A big hand for him. I will invite Munir and Dusri and uh, Faraj. And uh, Saad and Majid. So we still have uh, Hamad and Akil, are they? Akil? Yeah. So uh, uh, I would love to welcome you all and wish you uh, a very interesting slush journey, Doha slush journey, and uh, please present your startups to, to the audience and the people, and, and bear in mind that there is audience voting. So uh, I think we should show that audience are contributing into this. So, so uh, Abdelaziz, please uh, proceed. Uh, uh, do we have a mic, please? Bismillah uh, rahim First of all, I want to uh, Thank you for inviting me from Saudi Arabia to this uh, great and fantastic event. Uh, my name is uh, Abdulaziz Al Shalhou. I'm uh, from Saudi Arabia. I uh, graduated from uh, King Saud University from computer science, and um, today I'm going to present a new idea that I just started um, 
around maybe four months from now. It's uh, called Ad Souq. The uh, idea is about uh, connecting the advertiser and the uh, publisher through the social media. And um, maybe we'll continue uh, more about the idea when we present it at 4 p.m. inshallah. Yep. And uh, again, thank you. Uh, I would like to thank uh, the, the organizers of uh, this event uh, for giving us the opportunity to present our companies today. And uh, I am the co-founder and the creative director of uh, Gernas Company. We are a creative local Qatari studio that makes uh, local games and creates local content. And uh, we have uh, launched a few games already in the market. Munir is my partner. So. Uh, Munir al uh, the managing director and uh, uh, the co-founder of Gernas. You know what's the challenge today? The challenge is that uh, usually in Qatar, when you have uh, you're hosting someone, usually let them win. But today, <laughs> unfortunately, <laughs> we cannot let you win. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, hi everyone. I'm Saad Al Gahtani. Uh, I'm here uh, with uh, Fight Technologies, uh, myself and my partner, uh, Majid Lababidi. We have established Fight Technologies, which is the first Wi-Fi advertisement uh, company in Qatar. Uh, we both met in uh, Stars of Science, uh, a scientific show, which is uh, a show run by Qatar Foundation for young scientists and um, entrepreneurs um, to, to develop their ideas. And we decided to take one of our ideas a bit further and actually implemented in the market. So we've started, we're uh, keen to present it to you and looking forward to, to present it in uh, maybe a few minutes. Assalamu alaikum, uh, Majd Bidi as my partner Saad said, we are here, actually uh, briefly we're here to win, we're here to go to Finland, inshallah. So I'll see you there, uh, we're for us at four o'clock. Okay, great. Assalamu alaikum, I'm Akhil. Uh, I'm me and my founder, co-founder, uh, Hamad Raveli. We started up with an idea called TQ Fun, uh, which is like the most happening thing here because it's events, what we do, and we do online ticketing with recommendation engine, like the first time in the Middle East and the region. So watch us out for the presentation, and we are looking forward for Slush. <laughs> right. Yes. Uh, uh, Assalamu alaikum. My name is Hamad Raveli, uh, founder and CEO of Ticket Fun. And we are here uh, to compete with these gentlemen, okay, and ladies as well. And uh, we are here to win, actually, and we will win. Thank you very much. Great, so we'll be having four winners then, huh? <laughs> I like the energy. So, Abdelaziz is alone, so I'll pitch for Abdelaziz, actually. So, we'll be partners together. <laughs> Wallahi, we invited the three Saudis. We would love to have them on board, yeah. Thank you so much. So, thank you so much, guys. So, uh, 